to my channel. So for today's video I thought we would have a little sit down and talk about Halloween 2022. So as you can see I'm all dressed like decked out for Halloween basically um, in this dress. Uh, this dress is from Rose Gal, I think. Um, like ages ago so I thought I just would wear it today like why not um so yeah I thought I would wear it for this video because this is a Halloween video and I feel like I need to wear some type of like Halloween type look you know so um yeah I thought I would go with this dress it is um like this spiderweb dress it's got all these spiderwebs all over it and then the sleeves there's kind of really no sleeves but there's just this really like one long thing like of mesh like hanging off of the uh, shoulders um, and it's kind of like open as you can see so they're not really they're like sleeves but not really um, but yeah I just really wanted to wear this today I don't know why but I am in the Halloween spirit you guys like I am so excited for Halloween this year and I know that like when I post this video it's going to be July and you'll be like what are you talking about Halloween isn't until like a couple of months away but no for me Halloween I like do it year round basically I mean obviously you can tell by <laughs> my background and like my channel I do it like year round and um, yeah I just love Halloween so much and I feel like this year is going to be a really good year for Halloween. I feel like this year is going to be like a normal year I feel like because obviously the last couple of years hasn't really been that normal for Halloween because of COVID so I feel like this year is the year that we can get back into like normalcy with Halloween if that like makes any sense at all um, but yeah I just really hope this year is a good year for Halloween even though I know Halloween this year is on a Monday which kind of like sucks because uh, it's on a Monday so uh, but thankfully I'm not at the sanctuary on Monday so um, at least I will be able to you know like wear makeup on the day um, so and like dress up so that's good uh, that I won't be at the sanctuary but it's just really annoying that it's on a Monday this year you know so um, but yeah so uh, this year for Halloween I just want to kind of like go all out and I, I know I say that like every year that I want to go like all out for Halloween but this year I feel like I really want to step up my game especially with my Halloween videos and I just really want to step up my game with um, decorating as well and I feel like I started doing that last year um, but this year I want to go even bigger so I want to go bigger and better this year um, than ever before and I'm just so excited because I feel like this year is also going to be the year that Fright Night finally returns so um, if you don't, guys don't know and haven't been with me for a while um, I go to a Halloween event called Fright Night which is at Movie World one of the theme parks on the Gold Coast and they haven't had it for the last two years because of COVID and I haven't been there since 2018 like I actually haven't been to Movie World itself since 2018 uh, which was the last time I went to Fright Night because I didn't go to Fright Night in 2019 because that's when I was going to Florida so um and I was basically in Florida for like the second half of October so I um yeah didn't get to do it that year unfortunately which like it looks like it was a really good year that year they had a it house like Pennywise they had an it house and it just looks really good so I'm really sad that I missed that year but I can't complain because I got to go to Florida and go to Disney World and go to Halloween Horror Nights that year so I can't really complain but uh, I just so hope like fingers crossed that this year Fright Night returns finally because they said they were going to return it last year and then all of the lockdowns happened and over like the Halloween period and so yeah they cancelled it again for the second year in a row so fingers crossed that this year is the year that Fright Night returns and I am so going to be going if it does uh, obviously um, I'm gonna go with uh, my cousin we always go together and we always do the uh, VIP tour uh, which is totally worth it by the way I would totally recommend the RIP is it RIP or just VIP I think it's maybe just VIP ultimate uh, terror tour 
Um, so maybe it's R.I.P. I can't remember, but like you know, rest in peace. Um, I can't remember, but it's the ultimate terror tour, and it is so worth it because you get to go in early and you get to have um, free food and free drinks and there's like a VIP lounge that you can go to like throughout the night just to, like in case you want to like have like a rest you know from all the craziness of Fright Night and you also get front of the line accent, as, accents? <laughs> front of the line access to uh, the haunted houses like all the haunted houses and the rides um, that are you know uh, on during the event which is amazing and you also get to go into the back like behind the scenes of some of the haunted houses and you actually get to scare guests inside of the haunted houses and it is literally like the most fun you will ever have in your life scaring people inside of haunted houses it is so much fun and um yeah so hopefully we'll be able to do that again this year because i've missed it so much and it sounds weird but it's kind of like a happy place for me because it's just so much fun and so fingers crossed that fright night returns this year and whenever they like announce that it's coming back i will be the happiest girl like in the world because i love that event so much and i've missed it it just hasn't felt like halloween in the last couple of years you know because of covid so Hopefully this year we can do that again and I will definitely be bringing you guys along with me uh, to Fright Night this year, uh, if it's on obviously, um, but yeah, they have to, they have to bring it back. The only reason why they weren't on the last couple of years, obviously because of COVID but, um, and all the lockdowns, so yeah, hopefully this year is the year that it comes back. Um, so that is one thing that I'm probably most looking forward to this Halloween season. Um, so yeah, I just really cannot wait anymore because I think when we get back from the trip, because obviously this video is going up um, when I'm away on our little road trip, when we come back, I'm basically in full on Halloween mode. I'm going to be starting to get ready to film my Halloween videos because I like to film them early. I film them around like August uh, time because I like to start in September, as you guys know. So I'm going to be in full on Halloween mode when we get back. Um, so I'm going to be changing the background. I don't know what theme I'm going to go for yet this year for my Halloween videos, but I am going to be changing this background. Um, so yeah, I don't really know what I'm going to go for. I was thinking maybe Stranger Things because obviously that came back this year. So I don't know if there's some type of like Stranger Things scene setters that I can get. Um, so maybe like Stranger Things. I have got like a list on my computer for different type of themes that I can do for a background. So um, yeah, Stranger Things is one of them. Um, and I've also gone for like a gothic, like... Uh, haunted mansion type vibe and um, yeah I don't know just I kind of want to do something totally different so maybe stranger things and um, yeah I don't know but those are a couple of ideas I have for backgrounds and I was kind of planning to maybe do 31 days of Halloween again this year but I just don't know it is a lot of work and it takes up a lot of time and it's just me like I'm the only person who's doing it and um, yeah, so it's a lot of work, 31 days of Halloween. But if you guys want 31 days of Halloween back this year, then let me know in the comments below and I will do it if you want it. But like, it's a lot of fun, like dressing up and everything, but it just takes up so much time because um, like I said, it's just me. I film everything, um, I edit everything. And so yeah, it takes up a lot of time, but um, yeah, hopefully I might do it this year. I don't know, we'll see. But I am just so ready and so excited for Halloween this year. It's like unbelievable. But um, yeah, I am starting to lose my voice. I don't know if you can tell, but <laughs> I've been talking for way too long. Um, but I just kind of wanted to film this video because um, I wanted to let you know that Halloween is coming on this channel. And hopefully we'll be able to do a couple of Halloween decor hunting videos as well. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do them like this early because um, our Halloween stuff doesn't come out until September, October. Which is really annoying because we're so behind on Halloween here in Australia. So um, I've seen other people like in America do 
their Halloween decor hunting videos in like July and August so that is just like way too early for us here in Australia but um, I do like do some like online stuff so maybe I get some stuff online so I might be able to do a couple of uh, Halloween decor hunting like online version um, so if you guys would want that then let me know in the comments below um, and I will be able to do that and see what stuff is online because I feel like the online stuff comes out earlier than in the stores so I might be able to do that so let me know if you want that as a video or a couple of videos leading up to Halloween but um yeah so I am oh, I just can't wait for Halloween this year it's going to be really fun and uh, it's going to be even better if Fright Night returns. If Fright Night returns, like I said, I'll be the happiest girl in the world. So let's hope, fingers crossed, keep your fingers crossed that uh, Fright Night comes back this year because if it does, it'll be just the best thing ever. So um, yeah, and I'm sure uh, I will let you guys know if it is coming back. You will definitely hear from me So um, if they like announce it. So Miffy normally announces it like after they have this um, uh, event during the June school holidays, um, like June, July school holidays uh, called Hooray for Hollywood. So I think after that is when they might announce the Fright Night stuff. So um, yeah, once that's over, then hopefully they'll announce Fright Night 2022 because, yeah, if they do, it'll be so good and it will feel like uh, everything is back to normal. So, uh, yeah, let's hope for that. Um, after that event is finished, let's hope that they announce Fright Night stuff. So, yeah. Um, but anyway, I am going to stop rambling now because... I'm losing my voice, so, because <laughs> I filmed a video before, actually I filmed two videos before this video, so that is why I'm losing my voice, because I've been talking way too much. So, I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, let me know in the comments below what are you most looking forward to Halloween this year, for the Halloween season for 2022. Um, I'm just excited for all of it, basically. I just want it to be here now. And, um, yeah, I cannot wait. So, um, again, let me know in the comments below if you, um, want 31 days of Halloween this year. Uh, it is a possibility that I might do it. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, let me know if you want that. And, um, yeah, if not, I'll just do Vlogoween like I did last year. And, um, yeah. So, I'm gonna stop rambling now because my voice is leaving my body <laughs> so I'm gonna go thank you guys so much for watching and uh, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it make sure to subscribe and I will see you all again very soon with another video all right bye guys